Hello everyone, I'm going to show you how you can print your modules into booklet form. So, we are now busy, teachers are very busy printing modules, uh, especially uh, this tip. This is just a very simple tip, especially if you are in a tight budget or you really want to give um, modules to your students and you don't have much budget. So, the tip would be turning the modules into booklet form. The downside is that liliit yung mga text, yung mga figure pair, yung format, uh, yung kulay, at yung number of uh, band paper or pages na gagamitin ay uh, masyo shorten. Okay? So again, uh, your modules must be in PDF format. So just to give you a quick, um, a tut a simple tutorial on how you can convert your module, into PDF. So I have here in uh, my self-made module naka Microsoft Word siya. So to convert it into PDF uh, format, I'm going to click File, then click Save As, and then here I will leave the title, yung file name niya, and then yung sa Save As type, piliin ko ang PDF, and then I'm going to choose kung saan destination siya masisave. So let's say for example sa desktop, okay, and then click Save. So, I have now converted my module into PDF format. So, again, you have to make sure that it's in PDF format. So, I'm going to use an example here. So, I have okay, a copy of this uh, module, okay, Science 10, uh, Quarter 1, Module 4, Earth's Mechanism. So, I'm going to print it in booklet form. So, very simple. You just click File, click Print. So after doing so, gaito yung mag -itura. So ang gagawin natin is, as you can see here, uh, 27 pages, okay, just uh, to print this module. And kung gagawin mong back-to-back, -back, hatiin mo lang itong 27. So it will, you will need around mga more than uh, mga 11 or 12 or 13 uh, pages or 13 bond paper to print uh, this. Okay, so... Um, to do uh, to print it in booklet form, okay, you don't need to change anything here, but you proceed here, here sa page scaling, at piliin mo ang booklet printing. So again, since it's booklet, we have two side, yung front at yaka yung back side. So yung first thing nagagoy natin is we will be printing it at uh, the front side muna, so front side only muna, sorry, front side muna. So lalabas sa inyong printer lo yung lahat ng front side. Okay, and then you don't need, you shouldn't disarrange uh, the uh, the pages, no? So, kung anong labas niya doon sa printing, uh, sa printer ninyo, ganun lang. Kasi babalik niyo siya in reverse naman for the back side. So, as you can see here, uh, 7 pages lang. Okay, 7 pages lang. So, left dapat. Okay, yung binding niya naka-left kasi uh, nasa left, uh, diba? Doon mo siya i-stapler na side, diba? Or i, -i if you fuse yung mga pages. So, if okay na, click okay na. Okay, since nag-print na lahat yung front side ng ating booklet, ibabalik natin, we shouldn't disarrange this, ganito siya, and then ibabalik natin siya, itong side na ito. So, remember, lumabas siya ng ganyan sa aking printer. So, i-reverse lang natin at ilalagay natin yung para sa back side. Okay, since we're done printing the front side of our uh, booklet, so, next would be the other side or yung back side niya. So, click natin ulit yung file. Click print ulit. And then, here naka-booklet printing na siya. Uh, and then, let's choose back side only. Okay. Back side only. So, ready na natin ilagay yung ating uh, yung ating mga yung ating papel. Okay. Sa printer. So, if okay na, click okay. And let's just wait for it to be processed. So 
ganito yung magiging tsura niya. So, meron tayong, ito yung back side. Okay, ito naman yung front side. So, ang gagawin natin to arrange it, okay? So, papasok. Lalagay lang natin sa loob lahat yan. Ito yan. Okay, papasok lahat yan. Pag-arrange. So, pag okay na, you can now fold it. Fold natin. So, meron na tayong uh, booklet format ng ating mojo. So, yan. Pagbubuksan. So, pwede tayong kumamit ng...